Welcome back, guys. Yeah, in the last episode, we we doubled the size of our store, right? But we need to do a bunch of things to like get this like working properly. So um, first thing, before we do anything else, research. Uh, we're currently researching tools. We've done appliances, which unlocks washing machines and dishwashers and that kind of stuff. Um, but and we've also unlocked media supplier. Uh, but I think, let's say we've got luxury supplier, which unlocks jewelry, which is quite good. But I think, I think we should go for bus transport. Should we unlock bus transport? Let's do that. Let's do that one. Right, so that's going to take, that's like four days. So, uh, so let's, let's kind of get on. I'm going to pause the game because I, I want to get some stuff sorted out. Right, first thing, let's sort out staffing because staffing is, I think, becoming a bit of an issue. So, what do I want to do? Manage, SkyMart, and staff. Right, let, first of all, let's sort out um, stock clocks. Shall we? Yeah, let's sort out stock clocks. We have got two stock clocks and there's no way that they can keep up. With, uh, with getting all of this sorted out. So let's go and have a look at, at who we can hire. Um, you're, oh, Donnie, you're fairly fast and you're a good stock clerk. So I think we'll bring you in. Yeah, we'll hire you. Pause again. Uh, I wish it would stay paused. I, I, it's starting to annoy me, actually. Um, we got another good, oh, now you're, you'd be a good janitor and I want janitors. So, oh, pause and see, I've got to stop it again. Um, let's go to the maintenance center and we'll say hire a janitor. Uh, let's see, what did I say? Did it, did it, yeah, you'd be a good janitor, wouldn't you? Yeah, go on, we'll hire you. Stop it again. And, uh, well, let's see, have we got another good janitor? No, we haven't really. Yeah. I might bring you in as a stock clerk because at least you're fast. Stop again and go back to SkyMart. Right, another stock clerk. Yeah, we're going to bring you in as a stock clerk. So let's hire you. Uh, yeah, bring it, stop it again. Good Lord. <laughs> uh, you got good speed and stock clerk is your best. So you know what? I'm going to hire a third and stop it again. Right, so we've now got five stock clerks, I think. Yeah, we have. Now, you're coming to work in 16 hours. You're coming to work in... Oh, you're fetching stock. You're already at work. Now, you're going to come to work in 17 hours. Right, I would actually like you to start sooner than that. Now, if I set you to start there, would you actually come in then? I don't know whether you would. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Um, and then we've got Faye. You're coming to work in 17 hours. So I'd really like to get a couple of these people to come in, like in the afternoon. Uh, the thing is, it's two o'clock. What about if I said come in at like six, or seven? What about if I said come in at like nine o'clock? Uh, let's try. Now, still seventeen hours. They're not going to come in until tomorrow. Oh man. Okay, I'll tell you what. Uh, in that case, right, Colin. You're coming to work in 16 hours. I want you to get to work at 5. Uh, Sharon, um, bu -bu 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 I'm gonna, uh, I guess I'll leave Sharon where she is. You come in at 5. And Faye, you come in at 5. So we'll have the three of them. And then we'll have the two in the afternoon shift. Uh, which is going to be, what, 12? No, no 1 o'clock. And Faye, you're going to come in at 1 o'clock as well. Okay, yeah, that should be fine. Right, so that's them. Um, cashiers, I think we're actually okay for cashiers. But, yeah, we've got a good cashier that we could bring in. Yeah, not really. We've got another good janitor that we could bring in, though. Oh, and now and now we get a good stock clock. Isn't that sod's law? All right, yeah, well, cancel. Let's, uh, let's get one more janitor in, I think. Janitor. Yeah, yeah, you... Rich, you're hired. Right, let's go and sort out the janitors then. So, uh, sort janitors. Right, so we've got, you're coming in in 15 hours. No, you're not, you're coming in. Uh, well, no, actually, starting at five, yeah, that's fine. Uh, you're the afternoon guy, you start at one. Yeah, right, you are gonna come in at five tomorrow morning, and so is Rich. Right, so tomorrow we'll hopefully get everything cleaned up. 
and then I don't know. We, uh, once everything's cleaned up, I might fire one of the janitors because I think we we could probably manage easily with three. I would have thought, but we'll kind of see. So right, let's let's see how we get on with uh, with our new staffing situation. Um, we kind of want to just blast through today because there's not really that much we can do today. So I suppose we should kind of watch the tills and see like how is it, how are our queues doing and. If, the thing is, if we can get the whole place stocked up and whatever, then we can start doing some other stuff. Now, how are we doing for cash? We've got like 87,000. Uh, we could start thinking about either putting in a concession or creating a separate store. And I do kind of like the idea of creating some separate stores. I was thinking of having a bit of a mall down here, but I think we might be better off having a, a mall like a like a proper mall kind of thing somewhere else. I don't know, but we could do, and we could maybe. Oh, you know what? We could maybe do some concessions at like the bottom of here. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I gotta say, I am. I haven't kind of planned this out. I I kind of knew that I had to get the this place sorted out, but in terms of other stores, I haven't really planned it out. Um, bum, bum, bum. I don't know. We could do like I don't know. We could do like a little thing kind of over here, maybe. Have a, a few independent stores. Um, but we've got this, I mean, we have got this huge, enormous area to fill up. So, yeah. I don't know. I, I do like the idea of having an enormous store. Right, so here we go. It's the next day. How did we do yesterday? Right, we lost a thousand yesterday. Oh no, that was today. Uh, we made 4,000 yesterday. Yeah, there we go. Right, so we've got our janitors coming in. Should I slide down a little bit so you can kind of see what's going on? I'm trying to get rid of that so you can see what's going on. So our, our stock guys are getting starting to get our shelves stocked up. Good, good, good. Where are, oh, our, oh, where are our janitors? Oh, by the way, can I just point out, like... <laughs> Loads of people left comments. You, you remember when I was watching uh, this and looking for people with uh, with the heart eyes, right? I, I was looking just at this. People were saying, oh, I saw like 10 or 11 people with heart eyes. Yeah, in the rest of the store. I wanted to show you specifically a tech addict. That's what I was looking for. You see people with heart eyes all over the place, right? And yes, I do see them. I like, I'm not that blind, but I wanted to show you a tech addict. That was, like, that was the whole point of that. Oh, well, we've sold some laptops. And we sold some cameras. Oh, good news. Not selling many TVs at the moment. It, you know, it goes in kind of fits and starts. Sometimes you sell a lot and sometimes you don't. The laptops seem to be doing really well up here today. Need more of this stuff put out. Come on, get going, stock clocks. We're getting some stuff down here. We've got cameras down here now. What are these? These, um, these smart. I think these are smartphones, aren't they? Yeah, those are smartphones. And what's this stuff? Oh, video games. Yeah, anybody with the uh, with the gamer trait. Oh, see, look, he just had a. He was standing next to this. This is oh diapers. I bet you he's incontinent. No, no, he's not. Why were your eyes flashing then? What's that? That's that's diapers. He was there when it when it happened. So what did, let's have a look. What did you? Oh, toilet paper apparently. Oh no, were you standing? Oh, maybe you were standing there. Yeah, he had the little flashing heart eyes. But he just bought toilet paper, which isn't like anything to write home about. Let's be honest. How are we doing? Are we getting on top? Now they've implemented a new thing. In uh, was it the last patch or the patch before? Where if you leave garbage for too long, it starts spawning rats. We had another heart eyes and another heart eyes over there. Um, yeah, it starts spawning rats, and then and then your your janitors. Oh, another heart eyes there. Uh, another um, uh, one of your janitors has to has to come and catch the rats and take them away and whatever. And they and they spread from tile to tile. So hopefully we'll get this sorted out before we start spawning rats. Although I, to be honest, I would kind of like to see the rats, but it's probably not a good thing having rats in your store. How are we doing? We're up to five o'clock, my God. Well, our store clocks are doing a fairly good job, but our janitors, 
That janitor's aren't doing a whole hell of a lot. Well, they didn't seem to do that much today. Let's see, we're up to 92,000 though. We're, we're making some making some money today. Seven o'clock. We've got like what three hours left. Yeah, we should we should get up to four thousand. Well, maybe a bit more. My God, <clears throat> we're raking in the profits. Yeah, four and a half. My God, we're going to make more than I thought. Four, seven. Come on, sell some more laptops or something, or TVs, or something expensive. Why something good? What are we up to? 5,003. Yeah, 5,300. Not a bad day. Not a bad day at all. Now, tomorrow, hopefully, I'm going to keep a closer eye on our janitors and see if they can actually get this stuff cleaned up. Basically, what happens is... Um, every 15 tiles that they clean up, like these dirty footprints, every 15 of those that they clean up, every 15 tiles, you get a bag of garbage. That's the way it works. But, yeah, so there's, um, that, hopefully they should be getting on top of things. Let's just have a look at our, let's have a look at our janitors again. We've got four janitors. We have, we have three in the morning and one in the, I guess that's why not much was getting done in the afternoon. Let's, let's have a look at our janitors. Here we go. Oh, you picked up some garbage, taking it outside. Good. Did we reach the garbage? I wonder if we reached the garbage limit. Yeah, I, I would be surprised if we did. Because you can get a fair amount and the garbage truck comes and picks it up. So, yeah, I don't think that was the problem. Now, are we getting more customers? Right, so we went up yesterday. Let's see if we can keep that line actually going upwards. How's parking? Parking's fine. We're only peaking about like 40 cars at the moment. We've got parking for like 174. So we can get a lot more customers in our store. We've got room for plenty more cashiers. So if we start to see queues, then we can uh, we can ramp things up. How are we doing? Oh, we're selling some laptops. Either that or they, well, we definitely sold some laptops down there. I don't know whether that one got restocked since yesterday. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this. I am wondering if we need, like, another stock block. How are we doing? There's a lot of garbage to move. And we're already into the afternoon, so we've only got one janitor on duty now. Ooh, I hope we don't get rats. Oh, we don't want rats running around the store. That wouldn't be good. Uh, we've restocked the laptops. That's good. Oh, and we've restocked those as well. How are we doing? Ooh, I think we're actually doing a bit better than yesterday. It's uh, 7 o'clock now. We're already up to 4,000. So, yeah, I'm thinking we could hit 6,000 today quite easily. How much cash we got? We're up to almost 100,000. I, I, you know, I am thinking, I am thinking that a store or a set of stores, like, either up there or maybe, I think maybe down here. Okay. Um, let's assume we were going to do something down here. So how would we want to do this? We would want build roads. We would want customer parking. Um, we would want customer parking like all along there. Down there. Uh, now, hang on a second. Because uh, where are we going to have deliveries coming into? Oh, now that is a good point. Now, I wonder... I wonder if I did something with like um, a bunch of stores with like a central stock area in the middle. Um, so how about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, so yeah, 16, 4, 4, 16. 16, um, and then we have 4, 8, 16, 24. 32 across. Um, we want to, so I'm, th I'm thinking like if we did a store that was like 10 by 10. Uh, a cash desk is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then we got the queue. Now I think we want it bigger than that. Like I'm, I'm thinking maybe. So if we had two stores there and there. Um, well, if we did, if we did two stores then we could have like so we could do like maybe four stores four independent stores and then have so okay <clears throat> in that case what we'll do we won't have uh, we won't have parking 
there. Now I can't put parking there, which is yeah, slightly short-sighted of me. Uh, bu -bu -bu. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Um, bu -bu 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 -bu. Build. Foundations. Now, just like, how, how much would it cost me to do something like that? Right, that costs us like 100,000. Right, keep it running. <laughs> Let's make some more cash before we embark on that because that's going to be quite expensive. Um, I'm just wondering where I want the delivery and I was thinking of maybe getting rid of the two in the middle. Let's get rid of the two in the middle. Let's maybe have our deliveries. Deliveries and garbage we also want. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, okay. So what do I want? Uh, I want, uh, not manage, build and roads. I oh, know, yeah, remove. So I'd want to remove that and that. No. Yeah. Well, yeah, that and that. Okay, there we go. Ah, no, 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 I don't want to do it. Oh, remove that. Good job I've got fast builders. Okay, so let's, let's finish the road work for this. So if we've got... Yeah, let's see, we've got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, what? One, two. Oh, have I got parking? Idiot. <laughs> one, two, three. Oh, I can't, I can't, I forgot, I've lost count now. Oh, uh, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 so we want the same on the other side and then now if that's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yes that's ten so then we'd want that like that to create a full square okay and then we'll have customer parking all the way down there now I don't know what I'm going to do I don't know whether this store is going to carry on extending down here probably not I, I might end up running that road down there or something we'll see uh, but I definitely want parking there, and I definitely want parking there, and there, and there. And I can't put parking down there, unfortunately. Uh, and I've got the same issue there. Do I, yeah. Do I have deliveries coming on both sides? I'm going to have a, like a storeroom down the center, is what I'm thinking. Do I allow deliveries, or do I just have it? Yeah, maybe we have deliveries on both sides. I think maybe we have deliveries on both sides. Yeah, uh, so I want remove rover. Now just right click to cancel. There, right click to cancel. Good Lord. Right, we could put in a bit of like staff parking over here, maybe. Um, yeah, I guess we'll do that. Let's put a bit of staff parking, staff only parking. So we'll have staff parking there, staff parking there and there. We can. Customer parking in all along there. All right, cool. So what we can have is we can have like a delivery and a garbage on either side. How are we doing for cash? I've spent a little bit. How did we do yesterday? May 5,200 yesterday. Let's have a look at the graphs. Let's have a look at the statistics. And that's parking usage and net profits. Net profits, yeah. We're, we're kind of sort of going up. Let's have a look at um, sales numbers. Oh, yep. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we set, set a new record yesterday. Excellent. Good news. Keep going. Keep going then, because we need more cash. We need more cash. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, so I want to build this. I suppose I could build one store first, couldn't I? Yeah, I could do that. All right, let's do it. Let's uh, build. Foundations. So if I was going to build one store. Um, so if that's, that's 34. So halfway is 17. So it would be 17 by something. And then we've got the stock room in between. So the stock room. Now, the, the only thing is, I've I got to confess, I don't know if you can share a stock room between two 
stores. I've never tried doing that. I have never tried doing that. That's a good point. So I don't know whether I need two stock rooms or whether I can have one that's shared by the different stores. I don't know. I really don't know. Um, let's see. This is five wide, isn't it? Yeah. So let's assume... Uh, if I make it six... Now, this is going to have to be lopsided, isn't it? So, if I did if I did it five wide uh, and 17 deep, like that, and then we'd want another one there, and that's going to be the actual store. All right, well, let's get that done. What did that cost me? A fair amount, I would think. 40,000, maybe, something like that? I don't know. Not going to be looked, not going to be much left over. Okay, so we'll put in. Where are we? Uh, build. We'll put in our final bits of road. So I want a garbage pickup there, and I want deliveries uh, loading zone there. Okay, cool. Pause. Uh, no, don't pause. Why, like, why pause? The store's doing fine. We're getting on really nicely. All of our stores, uh, all of our shelves are stocked. We've got rid of virtually all the garbage now. Five and a half thousand. Is it a new, another new record today? Hour to go. Let's see. Did we set a new record for sales? For yes, we did. Four hundred and one. Yep. It's continuing to go up. Peachy. And our profits five thousand three hundred. Yep. Good news. All right. Let's carry on with this then. So what do I want? We want, um, what, what am I gonna put? Should I do, um, now you know what I could do? I could do like an electrical store. Ooh, I could do an electrical store. That would be kind of interesting. But now, yeah. Now I'd like to do, I'd like to do uh, maybe, a, I don't know, a clothing store maybe. What have I got? I've got 28,000, so let's. Let's do something over here. So what do I want? I want uh, objects. I want a staff door there so they can get into this stock room. This is gonna be the stock room. Uh, manage, oh no, assign. So this is gonna be a new store. And this is gonna be storage. And then manage the new store. This is going to be... What should we do? Should we do Nanny Giggle's Secret? She's not here, unfortunately, but I don't know. Maybe we can, oh, maybe I can drag her in for an episode in the future and then she can comment about it. Let's have Nanny Giggle's Secret. Yeah, go on then. Um, store 3. If I can zone. Here we go. And this is going to be Nanny Giggle's Secret. So, we'll all get to look at Nanny Giggle's lingerie. Ha, ha, ha. Awesome. Oh, we found if she were here. Right, so sign storage, that's our storage area. Uh, I keep going to pause. It's kind of just natural for me to pause when I'm building. Um, what do I want? Build. Now, we're going to want some checkouts. Uh, now, where am I going to have, like, I suppose, you know what, we'll do it like a regular. We'll have a door over here. We'll flip this around. Uh, whoops. Uh, Q. You know, I'm playing like three different games, uh, in fact, four different games, and all four of them have different keys for rotate. This one's Q. Uh, Transport Fever is um, uh, N and M. Um, uh, Oxygen Not Included is O. And another one, what's the other one? Oh, um, Sim Airport is R. Uh, like that, four different keys. Like, can't we have some consistency amongst games for what what the rotate should be? Anyway, shut up, Scott. Um, let's have let's have a check out there check out there now we're not going to need like a lot of checkouts for a store like this because it's not going to be high volume um, or at least I don't think it's going to be high volume right what do we want to what do we want to have in here we're going to want a mixture of um, shelving and clothes racks so yeah I'm thinking that we're going to have something like say like so clothes rack clothes rack Close rack, close rack, close rack, close rack. Then we're going to have shelves. Um, 
I guess, shelves all along like this back wall. Although it would be like, ah, uh, okay, let's, let's do it like, I want to, oh, there's a gap in the middle. I'll have to, you know what, I'll put something decorative in there because you can, you can put decorative stuff as well. You've got stuff like, where are we? You've got like, um, you know, yeah, I mean, tr uh, trash cans, plants, a pinball machine, fountain, ATM, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, should we have a, should we have a fountain in the middle? <laughs> No, I don't think we will. But we might, I don't know, we might have a fountain somewhere around the place. I, I've, got, I've got to say, I'm actually kind of tempted to put a fountain right in the middle of Nanny Giggle Secret. But it costs 20,000. It's not cheap. So, more shelves and stuff. Where are we? Um, shelves. Uh, what can you buy? Uh, that's, uh, ah, jewellery. We will want to sell jewellery in here at some point. We'll need a table at some point. Ah, you know, maybe, ooh, maybe we have jewellery on a couple of tables so that when people come to the checkout, they're like, ooh, shiny. What do you think? Should we do that? Yeah, go on then. So we'll have, um, well, should we have there and there maybe? Uh, I'm just thinking of the spacing. Obviously, we've got the shelves there. Uh, how, oh, yeah, I need to think about my cues. I need to think about my cues. Um, so where's where's the cash register? Checkout counter. Here we go. So if we flip you around, so your queue is is along there. Your queue is along there. Uh, that's a little bit awkward. Really, that one should be there. All right, let's put you in there. Move you. Okay, well, that makes life easier. Um, build. So I want to get rid of that. So we'll have we'll have a table there and a table there. Do 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 clothes racks. We'll have more clothes racks. Right there, 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 there. Now here. Yeah, that's right. So clothes rack, clothes rack, clothes rack, clothes rack. And then more shelves around the outside. I can take it off pause now. Um if we if we have shelves, right, let's put the door in so that I know what the hell I'm doing. Let's put the door there. So then we're going to want shelves. Uh, right, if I put shelves like... Uh, I don't want shelves like that. I can have an extra shelf on that side. Let's flip you around. And let's have... Uh, Shelves along there and shelves. Um, I am tempted to kind of leave some spaces for some decorative stuff. Because it is like, this should be a nice store, shouldn't it? Okay, you know what, let's um, let's take those out. Let's take those out. We'll put, we'll put a shelf there, shelf there. We can maybe have a couple of like, a, like plants in some of the spaces. Um, in which case... Let's take. Let's. Oh, they've already built that. Okay, fine. Let's get some. Let's get some plants then. So we've got plant type A and plant type B. And there's kind of no difference, so I'm not going to bother to using different ones. We'll have a plant there, plant there. We'll have three plants along there. We'll have some plants along there. We'll have plants by the door, and we'll have some plants in the middle to make it look nice. There we go. Is there anything else that we want? Do, 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 do. Uh, let's have a <laughs> toilet urinal. No, let's not have that. Well, uh, I was looking for the drinks. Where's the, right, there's a drinks uh, thing. There's like a, where, where the hell is it? There's a, a oh, water dispenser. There we go, water dispenser. Well, we could have a water dispenser over there, couldn't we? Do you have, yeah, see, really, I want it by the door. Let's, but let's have a water dispenser by the door, and then we'll have another one of those plants there. Right, there we go. Right, so there we go. Um, that I need to get rid of, because we need a door in, so that they can stock the place. That would be a good idea, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. All right, let's go up here. Uh, we want a staff door. She's going to be there. There we go. So we've got a staff door there. I wonder why that's bigger than, like, one square weird okay right we need um a couple of checkout 
counter people. It's three o'clock in the morning. Let's pause it because I want to get these people in. So let's staff, hire cashier. Yeah, you're a good stock clerk. Let's hire you first. So hire stock clerk. Who was it? You. Speed, patience, sociability. Yeah, well, you're still going to be a stock clerk. Um, hire. So you, we're going to need... Well, let's see. Should we do, should we make this like a nine to five kind of store? Yeah, I think so. Let's see. Um, yeah, nine to five. This is going to be nine to five. So nine to five, we'll just have one person. So you'll start at nine. Yeah, you finish it. Five. That, these these lines are a bit weird. You're much better looking at this. Oh, oh, stop. I need a cashier. Cashier. Oh, you're a perfect cashier. Man, trust me to get a blooming really awesome cashier for a place where the speed isn't really that important. Oh. No, you know what? I'm going to... Pause. I'm going to hire you into here because... A good fast cashier is a good thing to have. So let's hire you into Skymart. Skymart, hire cashier, and uh, hire you. Pause. I'm going to have no cashier here today. It's eight o'clock now. I'm, she's not going to get to work in like one hour, is she? Well, like you've got twenty minutes to get to work. Whoever I hire, what do I want? I want nanny giggle secret and hire cashier. We've got a good cashier. You're, you're, you're sociable. You're a good cashier. Yeah, hire. Yeah, Lacey Williams. Pause. Now, Lacey, when are you going to... Oh, you're on your way to work? Oh, good job. Well done. Excellent. So we've got a stock clerk. We've got a cashier. Does that mean... I think we're ready for business. Um, status active. Hooray. All right. Well, let's, in that case, let's let it rock and roll. We need, uh, we need a delivery. Oh, here we go. Are you delivering over there? Somebody come and deliver some stuff. We've got nothing to sell. We've got people standing here waiting. Oh, because I put nothing on the shelves. <laughs> oh, don't you just love it when I'm a complete idiot. Um, right, what are we going to have? T-shirts, pants, dresses, shirts, jackets, coats. So there's three, six. Okay, that's good. And then products for shelves. Uh, bu, bu, bu. How so did, uh, clothing, men's shoes, women's shoes, men's underwear, women's lingerie. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll have, we'll do, we'll do like I don't know, we'll do like a, we'll have, we'll have a couple of men's shoes over here, and we'll have um, some men's men's underwear over here. There and come on, men's underwear there. Now I do wish that it would like show you only the shelves that you've got for this store, and I don't know whether there's a filter for that. Um, and then let's do. We could we could do some like cosmetics and stuff in here as well. Should be kind of interesting. Um, so we've got, we got cosmetics, shops and soaps. You know what I'm going to do? Cosmetics and, uh, soap and shampoo, sh soap and shampoo, sh soap and shampoo. Try saying that three times fast. And, um, and another cosmetics there. Right. So we've got men's shoes over there. So we'll do, we'll do some ladies shoes over here. Where are we? Let's do women's shoes. And whoops, and women's shoes, and more women's shoes. Okay, jewelry's going there, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. So now we want uh, women's lingerie, and women's lingerie, and even more women's lingerie. Yeah. Is there anything that I can put on those tables? Just to just to move some extra stuff. Not really. Now. Yeah. No, I'm not going to worry about it. Right. So over here, this is kind of the men's side, isn't it? But it kind of doesn't make any difference whatsoever. So let's have um, let's have t-shirts, pants, 
and dresses and then I'm going to kind of reverse uh, am I going to bring no, no I'm going to do it in sections t-shirts and pants and dresses and over here we'll have shirts and jackets and coats and more uh, shirts jackets and coats right um, so what goes on my last set of shelves uh, we've got the shoes shoes bim, bim, bim. okay what like what else could we put on there we, well we could sell like bed sheets I suppose um, there isn't really anything else um, we could maybe do like sell some books God knows what kind of books they'd be probably saucy should we do some saucy books there you go saucy books this is turning into Anne Summers rather than Plumbing Victoria's Secret. Oh my God. Uh, what else do we want? What else was I going to put in here? I can't remember now. I, uh, I had a good idea for what I was going to put in here. Mm. Uh, I, no, I can't remember now. I can't remember what I was going to put in. Any guys, toys? Toys. <laughs> no, no, we're not putting that in. No, stop it. Behave. We're going to put in. Oh, I don't. Oh, bed sheets. I wasn't. Yeah, let's have a couple of bed sheets. And have that kind of householdy kind of stuff. Um, cookware dishes, no, but yeah, we'll have a couple of bed sheets. Right, away you go. What are we going to put on these shelves? Don't know. Uh, let's have some more dresses and some more coats. There we go. All right, get some stuff out there. Are we going to have any customers? That's going to be the big question. Now that we've set this up, are we actually going to have any customers? None so far. Oh, 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 our first customer. Oh, slow it down. What's our first person customer going to buy? What are you going to buy? Oh, I need to select. Oh, you're the you're the stock person. Oh, oh, here, oh what did you buy? You bought, um, oh, you bought a shirt. Nice. What are you, what are you? Look at, oh, men's shoes. You going you to get some men's shoes? Oh, yes. Yes. He likes some men's shoes. Cool. So we've got a couple of sales going on. Excellent. Alrighty. So we've got a couple of warnings down here. Missed sales opportunity. Queues full. Ooh. Customers are leaving Skymark without buying anything because the checkout queues are full. Look at this. Let's have a look. Oh, look, our sales have gone up hugely. Uh, pause. It's well, we're not going to get anything done today, but we better get some more staff in for tomorrow. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong one. Um, Skymart. Skymart. Let's see. Yeah, we're not catering with this rush in the morning. That's for damn sure. So now I did hire one extra cashier. I think we probably need to bring in maybe a couple more. Let's see. You kind of. Oh, you're awful. So are you, really? Uh, maybe we'll bring Aaron in. It's better as a stock clerk, but but you are you are terrible. Can't we like fire you permanently? Um, okay, well we'll bring in Aaron. So hire cashier. Oh, oh, you'll do. Perfect. Rachel, you're in. Pause. So Rachel and Aaron, we want you coming in late in the day, don't we? So if we bring you now, hang on a second. We could extend our opening hours. Now, that's also an idea, because this we could make this a 24-hour store. We could um, close at 7 in the morning. So we could make it 24 hours. Ooh, that's a bit of a challenge. I'm going to need to hire some more people if we do that, I think. Yeah, should we do it? Yeah, let's do it. So let's hire. Uh, -bum -bum. Yeah, I'm going to bring you in. Pause. Hire another one. Yeah, it's going to be you. Hire. Right, let's let's play around with the cashiers then. Cashiers. Let's start at the end of the day and work backwards. So, you are going to be starting at 3. Well, we want you to start at 4 then, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, 4 for 8 hours. Yeah. So, you are also going to be four o'clock i think we're like like really late 
we only need like a couple of people, I would have thought. So we're going to get you uh, to start, let's say, at two. And then we'll get you, uh, at, let's say, 12. Um, have you in at 12 as well. Now, if we bring you in at like 10. And Denny Crane, Denny Crane. Bring you in at 10. Oh, no, let's bring you, yeah, let's bring you in at 10. Kim, we'll have you in at 11. Try and keep up with that. Uh, Ronald, you're going to come in. Ooh, let's have you. Let's have you there. Karen. Ooh. Uh, let's have Karen. Eight. Denise. Oh, dear. Denise at eight. Rita. Let's have you at six. Tom, you six. Jeff. Uh, what do we think? Four. I don't think we've. I don't think we've got enough people in later in the day. Uh, let's go back to. So Kim, you're starting at eleven. Yeah, you're going to need to be one. Denny, let's move you out to. Uh, one. Oh yeah, yeah. It's tricky sorting all this out. Uh, so Karen, let's have you there. Denise, yeah, that might be all right. R uh, Rita, let's have Rita there. Tom, uh, Jeff. Oh, come in at th three. Okay, let's have you at five. I've still got a bunch of people to move, so let's say you're coming in at five. Rita, five. Uh, Sarah, let's say you were coming in at like th two. Now let's put you later in the day. Let's have let's have you there, and then. Now, if you're coming in at midnight, uh, why does that look like it's not giving me coverage? It looks like we've got nobody coming in, but I think we have. Okay, you, you're going to have to come in at midnight as well, because I think we need two people on the tills at all time. So let's... I think we do it like that and kind of see how we're doing. But I'm, I'm thinking we probably need to extend one of our people a little bit further out. Denny, you're coming in at 1. You're at 1. Oh, you're at 12. What about if we extend you out a little bit? Uh, you're coming in at 12. Let's make that 1. Uh, yeah, that's... Oof. Man. Well, I think we're just going to have to see. I think we're just going to have to try it and see. It's one of those kind of suck it and see things. We'll have a look at the... the, the dis the display tomorrow. The thing is, this is actually showing us our old hours. This is going to be radically different, but I don't think we've got anybody. It, it's like we haven't got anybody in here. Or is this showing us? No, we, we've got two people coming in at midnight. So, um, you're coming in at midnight. You're coming in at midnight. Why isn't that there? And then you come in at five. All right, we'll see. We'll see how we do. Look at these queues. No wonder people have been getting upset. Those big long queues. And look. Yeah. Oh, look at the... Look, they get very irate. They go red in the face. Get very upset. How are we doing? We've had two customers left unsatisfied and they won't come back tomorrow. But I think, I think we're generally going to be okay. We'll see. We'll see. How many cashiers have we got on at the moment? We've got three cashiers working at the moment. I think we're going to need more. How are we doing over here? Wait, wait, is it oh, just four o'clock? It's four o'clock in the morning. Good Lord. And we don't have any uh, stock clocks or janitors in the middle of the night, but I don't think we need them. 
we'll, uh, I guess we'll kind of see. Our janitors do seem to be on top of things. That's really good. Our stock clerks seem to be on top of things. That's good. Sales are still going up. What, what was the profit yesterday? Whoa, well, holy. Seven and a half thousand we made yesterday. Awesome. Okay, we, we seem to be doing okay at the moment. I think we need to crank up some more cashiers for tomorrow. We're keeping up so far. How's things over at... Uh... Yeah. Now, can you... Uh, this is a good point. Can you see the individual... No, that's research. I didn't want research. I want statistics. Um, bum, bum, bum. What the hell's this? Yeah, comparison. I want to see, like, the performance of an individual store, but it doesn't look like I can do that. Which is a little bit frustrating, isn't it? Um, I suppose if I go to manage, I can look. So if I go to Nanny Giggle Secret and go to Zone, then I can see. So we're mainly clothing, um, but we're we're losing money at the moment. Oh, we're starting to get a few more customers. I mean, yesterday, well, I don't think we had all the stock out yesterday, so... It's very cool, isn't it? All the, the stuff laid out. Shirts and dresses and coats. Jackets. Shirts. These are t-shirts. Shoes. Men's lingerie. Oh, sure. let's have a close-up on the women's lingerie. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, come on. You know you wanted to look at it. Don't give me that. Right. Um, yeah, how do I get to go? Let's see what the profit is the next day. But we're, we're making good money over in Skymark, that's for damn sure. Let's have a look, Skymark, where are we? Skymark, profit margin is 77, that's good. We did lose a few customers, which is not good. We need to make sure that doesn't happen again. How are we doing? Yeah, two customers left unsatis unsatisfied. So we need to be a little bit careful of that. But let's see, so profits, eight. 8,300. Wow. Nanny Giggles. Oh, look at this. Nanny Giggles made a profit. Net profit. Um, 1,200 profit from a little a little clothes store. That's Britain. Nanny Giggles will be pleased. She'll be very happy. Awesome sauce. Um, let's pause. Um, I want to bring in a couple more um, a couple more staff members. But you know what? If you want to see that, yeah, you know what I'm going to say. You'll have to come back for the next episode. We're going to leave it there. Things have moved on beautifully. This is running great. We're making we're making really good profits. I'm really impressed with the profits. I didn't think we'd be making quite that much this quickly, because we're, we're making like, well, now is that show is that that showing me the overall profit, isn't it, of adding those two together? I assume um, it's got to be. Yeah, it's got to be. So we so we made a total of eight thousand three hundred. Now that means we only made about um, seven, uh, yeah we only made about seven thousand here. So yeah, we need to. Uh, oh no, sales is still going up six hundred and two. I thought sales had gone down. It's the net profits that dipped. Ah right, we'd have lost some money because of here. Yeah, yeah, but now that's um, now that's going back up. Oh, things look really good, guys. Leave me a comment if you've never left me a comment before. Leave me a comment. Say what you think. Uh, you've got ideas. If you've got um, things you want me to do, let me know. And I will catch you for the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace out.